Hey folks, Quilly Teen here and welcome to another episode of Let's Play RimWorld. It is Wanda's Legacy. And we are starting things off with a ritual to see if we get someone else to join us. We don't really need more people. We've got all the tasks handled. And in the middle of this, we get a mechanoid cluster. Okay, we do not have, um, we don't have mortars yet, which is a darn shame. Sunblocker would be annoying. This turret is going to be the worst. But we do have a couple of EMP grenades, which is nice. Huntsman. Oh, do you still have gut worms? Are we still not over that? Oh, that's not going to help us. All right. Fun thing and a drifter named Poppy. So Poppy, first of all, where'd you spawn? Down there. Are you wearing probably just a dyed shirt? No, it is a devil's trans shirt. Poor quality, but wow. No health problems? Misandrous teetoler. Misandrous and misogynist. I just hate everyone, says Poppy. Poppy, I feel you. That's some pretty good animals. You know, I said there's not really anything we needed. But. I'm sorry. Ordening carrying disabled. Oh, there, I was looking at the wrong column. Okay, I was gonna say, hold on, something doesn't work out. So yeah, you're a great animal handler. We could use that to maybe tame some stuff. That's kind of okay. You are allowed to fight. You've got, I mean, you don't have much skill right now, but you do have shooting passion. I think, congratulations, you're gonna survive. Now, what does the rest of this look like? Oh, I like that you have construction passion. I like that a lot. You know, I'm, I'm officially going to go ahead and turn that off now. Yeah. I mean, we have our constructor bot, but that's okay. We got a couple people with maybe a little more skill. Animal handling. If there's no animal handling, try construction. If not, I mean, if you can grab some cooking, you're not going to poison people. So we could put that as the three. That's fine. And then that, just the regular busy work kind of situation. All right, now this auto pistol is not going to cut it. Um, we are... We'll get you... Uh, mm, I don't know. I don't know. And the DPS here... Next, armor pen 9%. 18, armor pen 14%. Yeah, we'll give you the shotgun. But we are going to put an order in for another heavy SMG. We'll give you a chance to get a, your weaponized. Laura's pregnant. But I think we need to get you prepped for combat here. Darkness soaking wet. I dislike xenotypes. Oh, wait. Oh! <gasps> I forgot. Zeke is a dislike xenotype. Oh, I forgot about that. I completely forgot about that. Um, I had wanted, um, I can't remember if I talked about it in the episode or not, but I had decided that the next time we can do a reform, we are going to drop the uh, xenotype restriction, mostly because it blocks us from doing fun genetic stuff. Um, but also, I probably wouldn't have recruited Zeke right away. Squirt has inspired creativity, so we should get him to build some cool piece of furniture. We have eight days to deal with it. Hopefully we will remember. We're gonna give Poppy a chance. Okay, finish getting dressed, take a paroxyclin. Can you get a mood boost? That'd be real nice. You know, solar pinhole over here, just to give us more areas with some light, just to restrict some of the unhappiness and things like that. Okay, get some sleep, that's fine. Oh, Poppy, uh, schedule, copy, paste, and then you as well. Because, yeah, if you can get yourself a decent sleep here, that should boost your comfort. There you go. Get a few mood boosts. But we're going to have to go and attack. Emily needs some treatment. Huntsman, can you get up and tend to Emily? Okay. 
good. Fully healed. Is that a good trader? Poison Grouse. Okay. Country's awake. Although she is injured. Um, we could sell some cattle as well. So, I mean, conceivably, okay, we're not going to buy that much Neutromine. No matter if, even if it's got the memes. Oh yeah, we've got nothing to sell you other than maybe cattle. Which, you know what? Let's sell these two. Yeah, we can't afford all these advanced components. There we go. Some components. Some advanced components. Um, unless I don't want to prioritize these. I mean, we need four for something. Do we need four for the fabricator? It might be two, but I feel like it might be four. Let me turn that. So we'll get two more. So that'll bring us to four. And then I will buy some extra Neutromine. I have a feeling we're going to need some medicine in a sec here. Okay. Except. Tell you what, Squirt. Should we just give you the EMP grenade? Or we give that to Poppy. Let me give that to Poppy right now. She's going to consume a fine meal, which will make her not hungry. Get the boost to her mood. Yeah, get this. Um, and Squirt. I mean, I know you'll be inaccurate, Squirt, but I don't think it's going to matter. For the EMP grenades. Okay. This is going to terrify me more than a little. Let's get in position. Cover's bad. Well, we can do some over here, which is good. Um, I kind of want to target the auto inferno turret first. Well, Askin can get next to it and just melee this. Although, then if it explodes, plus it'll still get a chance to shoot everyone else. Do I just set up in the radius of this thing? Great to get those unstable power cells. And something's gonna pop out of this. How insane is it to just put everyone inside that radius? Feels like the answer is very. Gunners aren't adjacent to this, so they don't get sucked into melee immediately. Um, someone's still missing, right? Yeah, squirt. Unfortunately, slow. Yeah, don't go there. You go here. Now we'll have to make sure Haskin doesn't blow this up while we're standing next to it. All right. So we have. Oh no, we do. We're missing someone. Laura, get your ass over here. Okay. Insane? Perhaps. Well, let's find out. Oh, that's bad. Actually, yeah. Poppy, can you reach that? Well, almost. Target that. Squirt, change your target here, please. I think I sent you there? I don't know. Fire. Okay, good. Get stunned. Uh, Haskin, I really need your fire to stop. You gotta go and melee that, please. Thank you. Um, no, don't attack the Inferno turret. Yeah, good, okay. Do that. You're stunning here, which is good. Scyther, Tesseron. Actually, yeah, let's finish off the Scyther first. There you go, just done. And then, I mean, the laser's real bad. But, okay, no, you're down now. Good. Squirt, nope, you're going to target there, please. Good. Stay out of line of fire, Haskin. No, 
an adaption. I mean, so they say, but do that. Except for Haskin, you're going to stay behind. Okay. So now we do need to attack this. Not with Haskin. I should tell you to go away. Oh shit. Okay, now it's exploding. Ow, that happened way too fast. We are very I I thought we'd have longer with the explosions. Oh geez. Uh is anyone not injured? No, everyone's injured a little bit. Happy it's raining, because it'll put that out. I'll have to put out the sun blocker, but that's okay. We got we got time to wait for that. Okay, lots of people pretty in that I didn't expect that. That I thought we'd have time to move away. That was less than ideal. Um you're actively bleeding, my dude. Well, there aren't enough medical beds. Um what I'll do is I'll explicitly turn all these to medical beds. Yeah, there you go. Set you. You're here. Um. Aubrey. Aubrey, can you tend to yourself? And then tend to others, please. You probably you're probably the first one back or something. So there wasn't anyone to tend to. Although yeah, you should have tended to yourself. Zeke. So Huntsman is consuming a fine meal. I'm going to get you to end over here first. And then Audrey. Yeah, you were starving. Rick. Thrive. Taking a fine meal. No, what you're going to do is you're going to go and tend to squirt. And then Huntsman, you're tending to Laura. Okay, well. Looking at Haskin. I think I, I really care for Haskin because they're a little baby here. But. As long as you're tending someone, that's okay. Oh, Len Laura's pregnant, so maybe it's that much more important that she gets looked after. There we go. Haskin. Oh, Emily's still bleeding. Get your ass in bed. Andre is taking panoxiclin. Uh, go tend. Then you can take your panoxiclin afterwards. Okay. Manhunter pack? Seriously? Uh, Labradors. Ooh, that is not the greatest. I don't love that. Now, a lot of them will fall to these traps. If you had an SMG, you might not have. No, you had the shotgun, that's right, because we hadn't built it yet. Some starvation. The gut worms is uh hurting those stats a lot. Some will get through. More than some. Is that it? No, one more. Now, theoretically, the, we might be able to capture some and then use Glitter World Medicine, I think, to overcome Scaria, but I don't think that's very viable. Um, if we use the numbers mod, look for enemies. No, okay, good. None. Unrecruit everyone and set these to be finished off for afterwards. That's going to be okay. And again, what I might want to do is allow these things to be moved. Infection. Oh, no! 
Okay, well, it's okay. We should be able to treat you fairly well. You can do a self-tend, which... I mean, maybe I should just turn the self-tend off. Did we get a third doctor? No. Was that the person I, like, killed off? Maybe. Okay, Audrey, you're getting some sleep is going to be very important. Oh, that's not going to... The gut worms... I don't know if it makes a difference. Um... Well, right now you're behind Emily reach health Audrey yeah she's asleep reach health did it work reach health immunity gain factor plus 25 percent yeah um I'm gonna take Panoxicon. What I'm gonna get is I'm gonna get Haskin to get up. Audrey, you're gonna be told to rest in the hospital until healed. Sterile room is gonna maybe help some. I don't know. Need these hospital beds to get done. Lack of power's a little annoying. Okay, wind's blowing again. That's okay. Oh yeah, the sun is still blocked. Um, poppies the one who's not injured also hold on i can't deconstruct these right now hmm well let's hope that this sun blocker doesn't explode and take out the powers is gonna be shooting xp no that's annoying gotta be actual combat i guess you got meals yeah Starvation, I think, is just because of the gut worms. Unless it's something else. No, I bet you it's this that we can deconstruct. This sort of latest threat type object, presumably. It is, and it did not explode in a problematic way. Where, here, here. Okay, we can deconstruct the mech node. The unstable power cells, we're going to claim, we're going to reinstall. Now, these things can explode if attacked. I think we're going to go there. Claim. And there. Nowhere close to our base. Oh, wait, is that the radius of an explosion? When they say large, they mean very large. Okay, cancel you. Install over here. The important thing is if one gets destroyed, I want the, don't want the other to get destroyed. We can wall these in afterwards as well. Should connect it up to the grid. Uh, you're being deconstructed. Power cell. This can be deconstructed. And the rest of it can be hauled in at some point. Okay. Lots of injuries. Audrey, how's your infection? It's looking good right now based on color coding. Yeah, okay, good. And it should be fine with bed rest. We've got decent doctors and actual medicine here. So I thought it would probably be okay. But I'm happy that we used our power as well. So we actually should go through and do these rituals um, when the cooldowns come up again, just so that we can get more conversion points because yeah, we are, we're gonna keep human primacy, but we're gonna accept that humans mean more than just baseline. Um, because that's, we set that somewhere. Oh, right here. Preferred xenotypes. Yeah, we're just going to get rid of that. And also do something else. I mean, we've got, a, we got a couple of missing body parts. Maybe it's time to embrace mechanics. Maybe we embrace transhumanism. And we do some bionic stuff. Actually sounds kind of tempting. I mean, it always does. It says a lot more about me than necessarily what's optimal for RimWorld, although Transhumanist is pretty good. Especially if you can you can just do the, uh, the nutrient paste right away with no penalties. Which is something we can do. I mean, if we do that, again, tear down this wall, and we put a nutrient paste dispenser in here, and we don't have to worry about cooking anymore. It saves a lot of time. Now, um, Transhumanist means we don't get a debuff from eating nutrient paste. Um, we don't get a mood bust, whereas uh, making fine meals does. But it's something we can just go ahead and do. Huntsman. Oh, you just need treatment for your gut worms, right? Yeah. 
hopefully soon. Oh, yeah, we have some medicine, which is important. Emily is fully healed. Great. Army's like, uh, we want to wait on the construction menace pods. Holy crap. Yeah, no. No, 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 no. Oh, Squirt was inspired. Oh, that's right. Ah, legendary hospital bed. Yeah, because I'd forgotten about it. You could have accidentally made a legendary shelf or something. Legendary hospital bed might not be the worst thing ever, actually. Hmm. And, oh yeah, we don't have the vitals monitor yet. But that'll be the next thing to do. Because why not? Look at any power fluctuations. Uh, is this all done? It is. Okay, so if we allow this, we need 340 steel and some components. We just said a lot of mining. Uh, we don't have the components. We're going to need fabrication soon. Or we uh, get enough trade goods and then assemble a trade caravan to visit a neighbor that we can buy components from. Maybe I just get another solar panel right now. Or even some more batteries at this point. Can we do that? I forbid this. Two more batteries. Make sure it's roofed. I mean, maybe we don't even need this because this does we do generate a lot more excess power maybe just two more batteries is all we need right now mm. psychic soothe female oh that's very nice thank you game squirt hit a trap dumbass well you didn't lose any body parts that's important any of these corpses will get carried over here just to remove them from this area it's probably okay it doesn't make much of a difference but it seems like it might be a good idea. Yeah, I'd like to unlock this as well, but that's a very expensive to build another one. Is it... Is, do we consider some trading things now? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, we're gonna have to fling stuff. I think we have to go to Transport Pod next, just to be ready to fling some waste packs. Are there any targets on the world map that we want to hit? The Worshipful Vegetable Village for an item. Farming, farming, logging, none of that matters too much. Okay, give me a, like a component work site and I'll be all over it. Is it possible we don't have any slate anymore? I don't expect that to be the case. No, I just think people just aren't getting around to those uh, crafting jobs. Caravan. 13 robes of normal plus quality. We don't have the material to make that. Yoke Persona Plasma Sword. Integrator Headset? Oh my god, these are huge things. How long do we have after we accept it? I feel like you get, you're given like a month or something. Robes. There's no way we're gonna have the material, are we? Eighty fabric. New. Oh, we do have leather. I don't. Know, do we try it?
I'm going to wait as long as possible before I accept the mission. Worst case scenario, we end up with a bunch of robes to sell. Is not really a problem. I'll make another heavy SMG, which... An Ibex to self-tamed. Ibexes are quite interesting. And actually, we've got some more on the map, presumably. No. Got no males. But it might still be worth taming these and seeing if we can get a male Ibex at some point. Um... Because if I recall correctly, they have one of the best ratios of how much nutrition they need versus, you know, how much meat and leather they produce or whatever. So more efficient than cows to keep a big herd. All right. Uh, refining. We are going to get tran pod, pod, transport pod next. Real logo disrespected. Yeah, no, I don't know it needs to be identified. Arg. There you go. Some blocks are happening. Thank you. Although, I guess we were making granite there. Um, I think I will build a second one of these. Because again, when we start using them, they... We kind of want them rebuilt fairly quickly. And we've got enough people who can do it as a busy job. That's nice. We still have this to make a second mechanator if we wanted to. Oh, there's nearby steel there. I missed. Uh, plague. Noxiclin block plague to involve people. Yes! Haha, <laughs> Randy! Ah, uh, you're not so scary now! What am I doing? Hello, Devil's Friend. Let's do a priority haul on that. Thank you. Good at these donkeys as a pack animal, too, if we're about to if we're considering making a trade caravan. And then we butcher all our cows. Maybe. Okay, it's again all females, so we're not gonna be breeding more of them. Yeah, that is something that um, Poppy can be doing for us. And yeah, Squirt. Uh, oh, you're helping the high priority hall. But you're nearly back. Yeah, missing slate blocks. How many we have slate left on the map? Oh, yeah, we do. I'll put a little hall on this so our lifter might help bring more slate nearby. But we must have been consuming granite for something else. I don't know what we were still building out of granite. Because that was done. Yeah, I'm not sure. But you should be making slate now? Yes, good. Okay. Yeah, and that is happening. We'll do that. Then maybe we start... Uh, prosthetics? Maybe. We could definitely use some. Friend Sam died. Ate without a table. Well, sucks to be you. So, Haskin, when you're asleep now. And Haskin's really... Oh, I can turn... Hmm. Maybe Emily's tailoring goes on for now. Now, the at the tailoring bench, the good duster... Okay, it needs to be 10 and above, which is probably fine. I mean, ideally, it'd be even better, but it's okay. Because Emily's slightly too low for that. I just didn't want to make her do that. If she hits 10, I guess she can make some dusters, but we'll be turning off the cloth, the, the her tailoring. And now we're just going to keep the make robes at the top. Chaplain can cast abilities again. Um, I don't know. We need to. I think we're good. Where's baby prep? Field doctor, someone assigned to child care. Yep. And a couple. Um Emily's got a double passion for it. Yeah, but we also want Emily's social skill to be up high, so that's gonna be okay. Yeah, we've got a medical bed. Is that the entire message about the uh, baby prep? Yeah. Skilled doctor, birth room, clean floor. Child care, prayer, food source. Oh, yeah, you can breastfeed, but we probably want to keep some baby food around as an emergency and a high quality crib. So that's right. Let's put in a job for baby food here. Um, and baby food kicking around. 
and the baby will constantly wake up everyone in the same room. So we're just going to put it in a separate room over here. Crib, wood, uh, that'll block path right over here. You know, with, with the mechs and stuff, that makes sense. And we'll make sure it's at least good quality as well. Okay. Self 10 for those gut worms. Emily's working on this. Yeah, because Haskin was also doing some smithing. Masterwork of SMG. Poppy, let's go and equip that, please. Do I want to make another Plasteel Longsword? I don't know. Maybe we should just really work on getting the uh, Persona weapon, like artifact weapon, and give it to one of these two. Probably Haskin, because he doesn't have a wooden foot. Sleep right now. This is fine. Although, why was Emily prioritizing the research instead of this? I don't know. Seems odd to me. Okay, working a robe. I always forget the production command. It should probably be on like constant cast as well. I mean, maybe there's like an optimal time to wait for it, but really, like, like it should be spammed every three days. It should be up one third of the time. This is still being disrespected, which is annoying. Let's work. Assuming a fine meal. Okay, that's allowed. And now, okay, you're gonna work on these late tiles. Good. And so is the constructoid. That's the thing. I thought, oh, we got plenty of people on construct now, and the constructoid. No, you're going to prior uh, it's prioritize by lifter. I'm going to get you to do it because you do work faster. There we go. No more disrespected symbol. Okay, it's going to help some people's moods a fair bit. Zeke is still in a terrible mood. Oh, are you working on some kibble? Okay, that's fine. And yeah, Poppy. Hey, yeah, you got your donkey. Cool. Um, leading it through the house is a little annoying, but still just fine. So yeah, uh, hold on, we got actual horses too. We're talking about that. Although again, only females. Apparently there's some sort of like anti-male thing going on here. Oh, stallions! Hang on. I guess we won't need the donkeys after all. Uh, I'm going to turn off the tame on those. But there you go. Mares and stallions. That's going to be great. Taking panoxiclin, milking the cows. Right, which does all have to happen as well. Although, yeah, if we can start breeding Ibex, that'd be nice. Nutrition, yeah, I was going to say, is probably getting hammered here. So, I'm going to bring down the adult female cows just to one right now. That's unpregnant. That's going to have to do just fine. And I'll probably... I guess I'm going to get rid of the donkey as well. There you go, Taming Stallion. Yeah. Okay. And someone should get around to butchering hopefully relatively soon. I think I'll get rid of these simple research benches. We'll recover the material from them. Yeah, she, ah, Poppy is so good at taming. We're doing some more mining over there, which is groovy. Oh, clothing upgrade. Not bad. And the Devil Strand, oh, still only 50%. Jeez, it really does take a long time. What's the full growing period on this? Like 20 days? 22 days. Which, as a number, doesn't seem that long, but that is half a year in RimWorld, and a lot happens in half a year. I mean, half a year is 30 days, but, you know, shut up. <laughs> Close enough. And yeah, oh yeah, and we are out of components as well. Although I did set the mining there, I guess I did set the extra steel mining. Let me actually cancel this. And maybe that, maybe we got enough steel mine for now. If you're gonna do mining, mine some components. So even with the lifter bot, like a lot of this stuff is not getting brought in. Oh, I'm an idiot. You're still restricted to the indoors, aren't you? God, that's gonna be a constant problem. Maybe I should download one of the mods that's got the alert. You just hit the alert, it changes everyone's zones, and then when the attack is over, you hit it, and then it undoes everyone's zones again. 
Yeah. Or, you know, mech is idle warning. I wonder if there's a mod for that. I guess it's time to put a cut in here. So I'm going to do that now. Hopefully we can do some trading. We are working on those robes. They're getting through. Um, quest expires in 4.4 days. So again, I'm going to wait as long as possible before I accept it. Because presuming, I'm assuming that there's a time to deliver that happens after you accept. So we want to give ourselves maximum time for that. Folks, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.